What happened to your face? My stepdaughter happened. Ah ah! Chiwanya. She did this to you? I don't understand. She put something in my wipes. When I tried to wipe my face with it, this happened. Oh, no. Why would she do such a thing to you? Why? To get back at me. For what? Please, I don't want to talk about it. As you're seeing me here, it's, my face is, is so hot. I feel like they're roasting plantain on my face. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Sorry, pardon my man. <laughs> pardon my manners, please. Those are the bones. It looks so good on you. <laughs> You're not serious. I'm not sorry. I'm just sorry. I'm just joking. I'm sorry. Yes, what is it? Oh, I know you're bad in guessing. Well, I was feeling feverish today and decided to go to the hospital. And what did they tell you that is wrong with you? <clears throat> I'm two weeks pregnant. <laughs> you are pregnant? Mm -hmm. So you're trying to tell me that little Nicholas is growing in this womb of yours. How do you know he's going to be a boy? Of course he's a boy. He is a boy, I know already. Henceforth, I do not want you to be doing anything in this house again. Leave everything for me. Hmm. For a pregnancy that's just two weeks old. Yes, it doesn't matter. What matters is that I do not want you to do anything again. <laughs> Leave everything for me, okay? In fact, I'm going to prepare something special for you right now. <laughs> I'm coming to join you. No. I will no. assist. Mm -mm. I said no. I said no. I'm going to relax while I go there, get you something special. Come <laughs> <in>. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. Come in. <laughs> this is sweet. <laughs> um, brother, what was it I wanted to talk to you about? I couldn't do anything. Yes. Really? Ah, I forgot that you're so terrible in guessing. Exactly. So tell me. My wife is too is pregnant. <laughs> I'm so happy for both of you. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. It's okay, I understand. I'm optimistic that someday God will give you your own child. And that will be soonest. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for everything. <laughs> um, today is a happy day. It's not a sad day. So let me just be happy. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. So, where is she? She's upstairs sleeping. You know, I asked her not to stress herself. Mm -hmm. She'll just be there, <laughs> relax, and eat. So to be the hottest dad in town. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah so funny, but it's all good. It's yeah. all good. Um, what about Chimoya? She's not back from school yet. Okay. okay. Uh, I think this calls for celebration. Okay? Let me get your favorite wine. Okay, dear. <laughs>
Dream. You will not give her rest for one day. What is even wrong with you? Eh? Hey, Ibo Daddy, I don't understand. I'm confused. You're confused? <laughs> eh? Of all the worst things you've done to, to, to my wife, your stepmother, the worst part of them is dropping banana pills on the staircase for her to match it, either die, break her arms, or lose the baby. But finally, she has lost the baby. You succeeded. Hmm? You succeeded. I was telling you that this girl is a witch who's been doing everything possible to frustrate me out of this house. You didn't believe me, oh. You didn't believe me. Now look at me. Look at me, oh. She has succeeded in taking my baby away. Hey! Daddy, I can explain. Explain what? What do you want to explain? Do you know the gravity of what you did? Do you know? Eh? Oto banana. Elysia, to sort of step. Oh yeah. See, you're going to go out of that gate, kneel down there. By the time the scorching sun finish dealing with your skin, mm -hmm. eh? you have respect. Ah! Oh, yeah. Outside here and look for you, eh? You will never return to this house again. You have to be there, kneel down, hands up. No, so I whenever can't. I want you to come back, open that gate. Daddy, no, no, open that gate. Daddy, no, no. I'll slap you now. Open that gate. On the mountain. Run, run, run. I don't know what in um uh 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 in Pekin. Do I? We're making rock in Pekin. Outside the gate. Outside the gate. People say if I open the gate, he go sack me. You don't see him. Now what do you make me say make I call you? You mean Chimwanya is outside the house by this time of the night? Yes! Yes! I don't know, I don't say uh, 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 in wife, that just bell, uh, her hand dead here. Uh, her hand dead here. No, hold on, hold on. Why didn't you call me earlier? I did wait too. I did think say, Oga go forgive in Peking. 
Eh, Tony say me can go open the gate for him. Eh, 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 Dalu. But till now, he never forgive him. And the pig is still there outside though. Outside the gate. Eh, by this time of the night. Listen, listen. Look for something to give her to cover herself from cold, okay? Just let her cover herself, I'm coming. Oh, one of them. Dalu. I've already given her the clothes to cover her body. Eh? I gave her a pack. May she take cover body. If you get, they make her no come kill a uh, uh, Yubu Beke. Eh? <laughs> that looks fun. Okay, okay. I'm coming right away. Just uh, hold. I'm coming right away. Please hold on. of your house or oh, instead you can take me to the village I'll go and stay with grandma and grandpa uh -uh. I will not throw you out I promise okay so tell me exactly what happened okay my dad accused me of putting banana peels on the stairs that made my my stepmother to sleep and she lost her pregnancy. Ah, ah. Chimoya, that was bad. Very bad. Catherine told me that you've been pulling some thorns against her lately. So I wanted to just tell me the gospel truth. Tell me how everything happened. Okay? I know. I've done all that. Just that the thing what happened yesterday is that she. What is going on here? Nicholas accused her of what she didn't do and sent her out of the house. Can you imagine? By this time of the night. Eh? So, you as the head of the house, as the head of the family, decided to bring her here. You know it's a thing of concern to me that you have been bringing people to my house on daily basis without my consent. I don't understand. This was urgent. I couldn't leave her out there in the dark. I just had to bring her home. Okay? Look, let me tell you. It is either she leaves my house this minute or you leave with her. You expect me to leave her out there in the dark by this time of the night. My brother's daughter, my niece. Now it is confirmed to me that you are not just heartless, but you have no heart at all. You have no heart. Be sure to shut the door after you. Olisa. Olisa. Let's go. Oh, let me get my car key. Come on. 
Where is my daughter? She's, she's still not serving the punishment you gave her. Oh my God! How can I possibly leave my daughter outside by this time? Past 11 p.m. She's just serving her punishment. Oh my God! Oh my God! Where's my daughter? I don't know. What do you mean by you don't know? Hey. Eh? How could you lock my daughter outside the gate? Hey, me! Hey! Hey! hey. Tina, I care. I will move here. Have you seen it? By village people. Where's my daughter? You're talking rubbish. Okay, maybe you lock the gate. I say, make I not open the gate. So if I open her, you go suck me, come out! Huh? Hey! You mean... Hey! Is it... She's not there? Hey! I don't enter. I don't enter. So you're here sleeping. You still have the mind to sleep while my daughter is missing. Catherine, I'm talking to you. Catherine. Catherine. So you still have the mind to sleep while my daughter is missing. Missing. Yes. I went outside to search for her. She's nowhere to be found. Is that why you're bothering yourself? She's probably gone to one of our boyfriend's house. Hey, my friend, would you just shut that stupid mouth of yours if you don't have anything to say? Since I have nothing to say, please allow me sleep. Oh, just interrupting my sleep now. Okay now, let me hug my granddaughter. Ah ah. Grandpa. How are you? I'm fine, Grandpa. What a pleasant surprise, eh? It's been a while your father brought you to see us here in the village. 
Sit with me, oh, grandchild, and I talk. Emma, you have grown so much. In fact, eh, very soon I'll be buying you big, big clothes. <laughs> your daddy Nicholas and your new mommy, they are taking good care of you. Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> now, talking about uh, Nicholas, where is he? Uh, Papa, it's a long story. Chimaya will explain everything to you. Mama, explain now. Uh, Mama, huh? I have to be on my way now. I have, um, I have scores to settle with my husband in the city. Scores what? Can you go and get the scores? Well, whatever it is, Nico, be careful. Okay? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Careful, woman. Oh, what will be? Everything will be fine. Oh, Chimaya. I will miss you, but don't worry, Grandma is here, okay? So, mm. promise me that you're going to take good care of yourself. Deal. Deal. <laughs> Auntie, the love you showed me, I can't take you for granted. You even went by ways by sleeping outside your matrimonial home just because of me. This day, I pray to the heavens to go out of their ways to grant your heart desires by giving you the fruit of the womb. Amen. 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 So, this so you'll be respected like the other wife. Amen. 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 Thank you. Hey! Thank God, you answer me. this prayer. Because My sunshine. I'll miss you too. Hmm? Don't cry. Hmm? Don't cry. Grandma is here. And grandpa too. Don't cry. They'll take care of you. Uh, Papa, I'll be on my way now. So, Mama, please. I'll see you soon. Okay, okay. go, go. Oh. One one of us, one of what if something bad had happened to you? You see, what I don't really understand here is uh, Catherine's disposition towards this. I mean, what, what did she do about this? How, how could she have allowed Nicholas to treat his own daughter like this? Eh? Suppose she were to be her daughter. Would she have allowed Nicholas to treat her like that? She must be a very wicked woman. Hey! I will teach that Jezebel the lesson of her life. So all this is why she was pretending so that my son will marry her. As soon as he got married to her and she came into this family, she changed. No problem. She has not heard the last of this. Madoya vam vam vam! I know what to do. I know what to do. I will invite Nicholas to this house and he will explain why he has to treat his own daughter in, in such a sinister manner. Eh? Just because of a child that is still in the womb. A child that we, we are not even you know, sure whether the fetus will, will develop into a, a, a human being. Eh? I don't want to go back to him. I want to stay with Grandma. <laughs> Um, he's your father, okay? He deserves a second chance. Oh, no, nah. But don't worry, okay? Um, let's see how things unravel. Huh? I miss my mom right now. If she was here, all oh, this would not happen. I know. But you have me. I am here. I'll protect you. 
You'll be fine. I won't let anyone hurt you again. I'll take care of you. Be good, cool, lass. Sister. Uh, brother. Have you, have you seen my daughter? Sit down. So, have you seen my daughter? Brother, sit down first. Sit down. I've not seen her. Sit down. What happened? You know, I, 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 don't, I don't just know my daughter's whereabouts. I don't understand what you're talking about. Yes, this is something that got me pissed. Then I sent her out of the house. Going out there to look for her, I, I couldn't just find her. But were you drunk? Have you ever heard that the best way to punish a child is to send him or her out of the house? What are you talking about, brother? I, I, I wasn't just thinking straight. Please, just help me out here. Help me out. I, I, don't, do, I don't want to lose my daughter, please. Brother, listen to me. If anything happens to my niece, anything at all, brother, I will never, ever forgive you. Never. Get off of my couch. I'm going for her. Get off of my couch. I'm not thinking you. So. Ah, can you imagine? My dear, I am finished. I am finished. What is it? My sister does not know my, 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 my daughter's whereabouts. Is that why you are paranoid? So this is not enough reason for me to feel bad or something. Well, before you came in, was... Uh, Watching TV. If I put in a retractor, that Big bro. I wait till you tomorrow. God is not a man that sleep no slumber. He rewards every man according to their walk. Maluba, nobody is God. All this evil. so wicked and insensitive to have allowed your husband send his only daughter out of the house to her faith how could you it's obvious you've listened to gossips and you've believed them before hearing my own side of the story i don't care about your own path of this story i do not care because there is nothing that will make a father send his little girl out of the house. You were there and you did nothing. I lost my pregnancy. Anyway, I did not expect you to understand the feeling of losing a child. <laughs> You've never had a single miscarriage. You heard me. Instead of you to devise a means to fix your marriage and get pregnant, you brought your empty self here, meddling into other people's marital affairs. Kati, you said all this to me. You, you said all this to me. 
after you have schemed your way into my brother's house. Uh, you think you will have the last laugh? You will not. I bet you, my darling, you will not. <laughs> Are you done talking? I mean, are you done making noise in another woman's house? Are you done? Take your empty self out of my house. I am not making noise. One thing is for sure. I will be back. I promise you that. I will be back. 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 I will Destroy yourself. As a plan, nobody is gone. All this evil is in vain. How long you can pretend no God is watching? My plan, nobody is gone. All this evil is in vain. How are you? Hmm? Mama? Good morning. Papa, you said you wanted us to talk. Your daughter told us everything that happened in your house. I mean, how could you? How could you chase your only daughter out of your house? You didn't just chase her out. You left her out till night. If not for your sister Noye that came to her rescue, she would have slept outside. How could you be this callous? Huh? My Violetta came out that night, but I couldn't find her. Will you shut your mouth? Shut that mouth. That gutter you call a mouth. If your father and I had raised you like that, would it be where you are today? Talking this nonsense. You made that came out and you didn't see her. And when you didn't see her, what did you do? You know that I couldn't whine. Um, 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 Nicholas, your daughter is bereaved. She is a baby. She lost the mother. And right now she needs all the love that she can get. Mm -hmm. You don't have to treat her like this. Papa, Mama. I am so sorry for everything. I'm really, 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 really sorry. Okay? Uh, trust me, it won't happen again. Uh, at least can I now take her home and right my wrongs? Mba, that will not be possible now. Yes. yes, it cannot. Because the fact that your wife was there she encouraged you to do what you did. It means something is wrong with that woman. And we must take care of that first. There's a problem. So you can't do that now. It's okay. I'll go back to the city and bring her here. First thing tomorrow morning. Better. Which, tomorrow, which is better? Go now! You are not staying in my house till tomorrow. Go now! Go and bring her. My dear. Just leave her. Go. Maluba, nobody is God. All this evil is in vain. How long you can pretend no God is watching? Maluba, nobody is God. All this evil is in vain. How long you can pretend no God is watching? Maluba, nobody is all this evil is in vain. How long do you pretend no God is watching? My love, nobody is God. All this evil is in vain. How long do you pretend no God is watching? If I put 
She's right there in the village with my parents. In the village? Yeah. How did she get there and why didn't you come back with her? Noelum took her there. But my parents refused to release her to me. They said until we talk. Me inclusive? Yeah. How is that any of my business? Huh? Instead of them to release her to us so she can face more disciplinary measures, they are holding her back. Anyway, I'm not going anywhere until I have a chance to go to that village. And what will you be doing that making it to be chanced? Huh? Hey, listen, listen. We are leaving for the village first thing tomorrow morning. Do you understand? And that is final. I'm not going anywhere. We summoned this meeting because of the incident that happened a few days ago. We called you here to know the reason you supported Nicholas in throwing Chimonya here out of the house. As a woman and as a wife, you should be clamoring for unity and love in your family and not tearing your own house down. Are you guys being serious right now? Oh, guy. No, are you being serious? Nobody is talking about the loss of my pregnancy. All you are concerned about is Chimoya here saying that I threw her out. I didn't even throw her out. It's Nicholas who did. Uh, Catherine, we sympathize with you over the loss of your unborn child. So we are not just blaming you solely for what happened. As a matter of fact, Nicholas is in this meeting because he's also to be blamed. Okay? You sympathize with me. It does not seem to me as though you do. Because all you are concerned about is your grandchild. For, uh, forgetting that, my unborn child would have would have as well been your grandchild. Dear Catherine, we didn't invite you here to banter words with us. We called you here to talk to you, so listen to us. But I have freedom of speech. So let me talk. You people are not being fair here. You're not. They're being partial. Hey, hey, my friend, just shut up. Mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Don't shut me up. Do not shut me up. Instead of you to caution Chimoya here for pulling that useless stunt, you all are seated here vomiting rubbish. What? The green snake in the green grass has finally shown herself. Papa, Mama, you've seen it. Mama, for what? Hmm? Shut up, you rats. Nicholas, take me home. The meeting is not over yet, so you're not going anywhere. Do you understand? I do not have any other thing to say here. You know what? I'll board a taxi. Meet me at home. Catherine, sit down. Catherine. Hey! Nicholas. Oh, you see it. Everyone has seen it. Chai. Nicholas. You are completely finished. How have you been coping with this nonsense? Hi! And what's the meaning of that rubbish? Meaning of what exactly? You're asking me? Why must you talk to my parents like that? How did I talk to them? I only told them the truth. But you know, like they say, truth is bitter. 
But you have to accept it whether they like it or not. Are, 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 you, are, you, are you mad? Are you crazy? He? He? If your parents did not give you home training, I am going to give you home training here. Because? Stupid. Do you slap me? Nico! Are you the king today? Oh, you want to You die? are going to kill me today! Yeah, you want to die, right? I'm tired of your mother's constant ill treatment in this house. She must leave. What? My mother is gone. You wanted her to go. Now she's gone. Your mother must go. She must leave. I can see that um, there is something wrong with your head. I can see that you are mad. Who are you even married to? Me or your mother. She cooks for you. She wash your clothes. You even take her out. What is remaining is for you to lay with her. That is what is left. That is what is left. I will pretend I did not just hear that nonsense you just vomited from your mouth. Lisa, you heard me. You heard me loud and clear. I am tired. Oh, Lisa, I am tired. Give me. Give me if you must. But this, this is not life. I'm tired of this life. I am tired. She has to go. Can't you see? She, she has to go. Wipe your tears and cry no if anybody had told me that Catherine is this wicked, honestly, I wouldn't have believed it. No wonder she has been pretending all this while just so she can get into my son's life. But let me tell you, it is not late yet. Because she can easily be kicked out of his life. Hi! Hi! Genika. Eh, is it not the book of Zachariah or... No, Jeremiah. How do you know what I want to say? You want to say the heart of man is desperately wicked. Exactly. Oh! The heart of man! It's wicked desperately. And no, no who can know it. Ha! Who? Look, that woman. That woman. <laughs> hey. She doesn't want to see my wrath. Oh. She doesn't want to see my wrath. If she does anything that is synonymous with what she did again. <laughs> oh. What I will do to her, eh? She will know that there is difference between six and half a dozen. My husband, don't bother your head. It won't happen again. I am happy Chimwanya is here with us. I should not go back there until further notice. I will not agree. Uh, uh, Genica. Nicholas is her father. Mm. Hmm? As soon as we overcome this impasse, I mean, he should be free to come and take his daughter. Until then. But as for Catherine, as for Catherine, hey! Hmm. Why are you going to? If you're not going to be a man, a man, a man, if you're not going to be a man, you're not going to be a man. Hey! Okay. All right. All right. All right. If I tell you what I heard from Marzia Kachi's compound yesterday, mm -hmm. you'll be shocked. What is it? And how did you hear it? You know we said the same things. Yes. So I heard everything they discussed from my house. They said that Nicholas' new wife is very wicked. 
but she pretended to be nice just to marry him. That's not all. That's not all. They also say that she threw Nicola's only daughter at night to die. And you don't mean they invited her, but she insulted all of them and walked away. <laughs> Are you sure of all these things you're saying? Of course I'm sure now. Why are you saying this? I think Nicholas is so unlucky. First his wife died. Now, the second wife he got married to is giving him issue. A wife he got married to not very three months ago. He's not unlucky. Hmm? He's cursed. No, no. Ah, what, what, what is no now? Eh? Are you not seeing it? Ha! Don't be saying such about Nicholas. Wait, thank God I did not marry him. Eh? If not, I would have been the one dead by now. Imagine me throwing myself at Nicholas when he's still young in this village. Eh? But he left me a home me, Kambili. Can't you see? He left me and married a city woman. Imagine that now. Stop saying that. Nicholas is not cursed. He's a good man. He's just been so unlucky with women. That's all. Eh? Just believe what you want. What is the truth now? Ridiculous. What can I possibly want from a cost girl like you? Can't believe. Hey, 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 hey. Don't tell me to stop. Don't tell me to stop, please. And the answer to your question. My name is Kambili, a beautiful maiden of this village who loved your father so very much. Not until he left me and married a city woman, your mother. But I thank God I didn't marry him. If not, I would have been the one dead by now. Whatever you had with my father in the past is none of my business and you don't have any right to bring my mother into it. And if I do, what will you do? Eh? Tell me, what will you do, you daughter of a cursed father? Miss Blessed, you are still unmarried and you're wambling around this village with poverty. How dare you? Don't you ever stop me in the road to say this rubbish. If not, you will hear from me. <sighs> Did you hear what that rat said? When I told you Jesus to Christ. leave her alone, didn't I warn you? I warned you. A girl that you knew when they gave birth to. She should watch her back. Where would I go and look for this girl now? Eh? With her color that is shining everywhere. She can easily be spotted. And when they carry her, where would I go and look for her? Have you seen my life? Jemwanya! Hey! Oh, Coco! Mwanya! She like me! I decided not to disturb you. You want to stay around the village? Yes, Grandma. Nevertheless, you should have told me. But you were sleeping. You could have suddenly woken me up to tell me you were leaving I the house. I want to disturb you. Come, please don't do that again. Okay. You got me so worried. I'm sorry, Grandma. It's okay. Did, did you make any new friend? No. Enemy. Enemy, what? Who is the enemy? Her name is Kambili. Kambili? Okay, now. Did she do anything to you? No, Grandma. She is indeed our enemy. Enemy to this family, especially to you and your father. Just because your father refused to marry her. That is why she's tormenting our lives. Don't go near her. And don't let her come near you either. Alright? Okay, Grandma. Did, did she do anything to you? She did not. Oh, you go inside and carry your food on the table. Okay. Oh?
do an apple sugar, honey. Now talk a man. It's what somebody used to play with me. Oh my man. Please can be I got the quenka. It wasn't my fault she wasn't married. She wanted my son to marry her. My son refused. How is it our fault? Look at who she's trying to make trouble with. Mom, but she, the person that uh, she was struggling the man with is dead. Why can't she die and leave the girl alone to live her life? Touch my child, I will kill you. Agadi, Agadi now warfare. Terrorist. Look at my, this one God just gave me, this one. Man. I wonder why Noyalome is hell bent on sending you out of this house. What else? What else if not for the fact that she knows that I am the one that will see through her and knows that she is devilish. Mother, she desperately wants you to leave the house. I think it's time. Time for what? Time to bring in another woman who bears a more fertile crown where your seed can sprout. Mother, do you think this is the right time? Hello, Katsy baby. How are you doing? My dear, I'm fine. No, I'm fine. How is everything? Okay, uh, is my brother there? I've been trying to call him, but he's not picking up. Oh, he has gone out. Hmm, it's all right. You're enjoying yourself. You're enjoying my brother's money. <laughs> Shop the money. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Uh, I will come see you, but not now. Please, not now. I'm just relaxing. Please, don't stress me at all. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> I'll come see you soon. <laughs> I'm just relaxing. Eh? So you are here? You think you will turn my son against me? Eh? You think my son will listen to you? Just look at you. You this shameless, worthless, useless, foolish, shameless, banner woman. Eh? Oh, you told my son to send me back in from his own house, his mother. Let me bust your bubble. Look, my son have now decided to do that, which he was supposed to do a long time ago. He shocked you. Eh? Which is? Ah, <laughs> no need of telling you. You just wait and see. Fruitless vacuum. Net weight. Local urchin. Look at her. Just watch me. You will see. When it will happen, eh? You will not have the mouth to say what you will see. I love you. Oh dear, Mama Gama, my heart is bleeding. Oh, oh, oh. Container has landed, as you can see, direct from the village. <laughs> you look great. I'm not part of I can't see. So, um, what's your name? My name is Omaka. Alpha Mubu is my name, Fido. And she's from the same village with us. <laughs> so, what's your academic qualification? Mama, what is she doing? Oh, um, don't mind her. <laughs> she likes being funny. So, are you a university graduate? Chineke! <laughs> <laughs> Ma! Ngana Wapoko! 
Mother, what's going on? Is she okay? Uh -uh, don't mind her. She's funny and she's here to make us happy in as well as she will do the other one. The more old and the more cool. She's here to entertain us. What is going on here? My husband. Who is she and what, what is she doing here? Mama, what is happening here? What is happening? Wait, are you expecting me to answer that? Yes, we all know you are a parent, but blind? Ah. You can see what is going on here that we are enjoying. Eh? Nem. Cheers. <laughs> and how it goes. Oh. My husband. My love. Please talk to me. My husband, please. What, what is happening? What, what is going on here? Eh? Mm. Ah, leave him alone. Eh? Why are you disturbing him? Can't you see someone is beside him? Ah. Now would you like to join us? Oh. Ah. <laughs> Cook for me. <laughs> ah, that is it. <laughs> um, um, can you can you sit up? Yeah, sit up here. Thank you. Yeah, that's um, Baho Bali. Baho? Baho. Baho Bali. <laughs> what kind of energy energy? What kind of That's an electric flame. It's like the flame of an electric flame. Um. Mama, are you sure this is going to work? My son, you have to relax. Eh? Everything is going to be well. The most important is the other one. If you look what? Who Mama? Who Mama? She will give us what we want. Am I not right? the meaning of this? <coughs> Why are you making food on the dining table? <coughs> I'm asking you, what happened to the kitchen? I can't cook you there. I'll cook you here. It is you that will cook there. What is wrong with you? Can't you see the whole house is smelling? What is wrong with you? What kind of bacteria are you spreading in the in the in the whole food that you're supposed to make? What is the meaning of this? Look, a pot on the dining table. Oh Lord, God, no, this is not happening. Mama, will you take this whole nonsense to the kitchen? Mama. Oh. 